Two rounds down, two to go. The battle for the Eastern Conference continues. Game one of the conference finals. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg alongside. And our sideline reporter tonight is Doris Burke. It's the Toronto Raptors facing the Cleveland Cavaliers. A look at Cleveland. Guys, win after win. They have been utterly dominant in the postseason. One sweep after another. And, and while I expect them to win this game and potentially win big, this is a team that really plays well on their home court. And if they do that, they can really set the tone for this series. Well, we'll see if they can capitalize. I mean, that's what you work hard all regular season for is to have the advantage of game one in your building. I'm with you there. I think you've got to give them the early nod as favor. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's check out who's on the floor, courtesy of Gatorade. Setting the floor for the Raptors. The star pair of Lowry and DeRozan are the guards. Patterson is the four with Dallin Tunis in the middle. And it's Carroll in at the three slot. Usually free throws are a formality for him. I didn't expect that result when he stepped up there. That's a quick bucket there. Solid in transition. Well, you know, he loves the chance to get out and run, and we could see right there why he does. Now, here's Lowry. Kicks to Patterson. Plays it in without an inch of room around him. First quarter just over a minute played. And a wide open look for Irving. They grab their own miss. And Thompson throws it down. And gobbled up that rebound and went straight into attack mode on the putback. Oof, he, he is one of the most determined rebounders part we have got in the NBA. Yeah, you're calling it right, Kevin. I mean, he gets so many second chance points because of how hard he works to get to the rebound. And that's the classic one-two punch right there. I mean, nice steal. And then how about the elevation, Kevin, on the finish? And, Greg, nothing spurs some quick offense like a great play defensively. That indicates the importance of great on-the-ball defense, as was displayed right there. Smith for three. The shot, no good. And Toronto will come the other way. Now about two minutes gone here in the first quarter. Lowry passes to DeRozan. DeRozan can't get that one to fall. Cleveland's gone 0 of 2 from deep here. It's 3 on 3 on the fast break. Thompson with it. Now Valanciunas defending. Irving, a good look. Thompson dishes to Irving. Love outside. Lowry against Irving. Second chance shot. Out to Smith. For the three, good, and the assist goes to Irving. Irving's got three assists tonight. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this league. Quality looks they're getting, and they're capitalizing on them, guys. They have to be happy with this start offensively. And he's starting to get what he wants here early and often. Nice move. Back to Smith. Outside Irving. to the wing right side for three Smith got it off in time but it's no and LeBron James trying to will his Cavaliers team to its first title teammate Kevin loves I mean, he sat us down uh, when someone like LeBron talks about what you need to bring to the table you, you better bring it <laughs> yeah I would think so you'd be better served to go right along with what he's talking about of the new big three along with Kyrie I think if they just keep following LeBron's lead and advice the sky's the limit and we welcome you back to our presentation of game one and guys what do you think about the offensive approach so far that we've seen for the Cavaliers fellas they're passing the ball the way you're supposed to here in this first half they've established their presence in the paint tonight also a lot of their scoring to this point coming from down low Pulling out the wings, it's Shepard and LeBron. Osgov is out there with Channing Fry. And it's Delavidova in at the point guard position. That's the five for Cleveland right now. Clock is at three. LeBron, no luck. Raptors trail by three. Ross with a wide open look. Here's Biombo. It's rebounded by Cleveland. He's always going to have a difficult time finishing when the defense is in his face like that. Ross with the steal. Now the Raptors moving it up. 
Powell kicks to Scola. Marzgov with a block. And here is LeBron. He dishes it to Fry. And it's Shumpert penetrating. Boom, he jams it straight down. Taking it to the rack with power right there. And oh. hammering down with the two-handed slam. Just piling on the lead with the dunk like that. Shot by Joseph, no good. The Cavaliers leading by five. Outside jumper. For three. Cannot hit. Now Toronto takes it the other way. And Joseph kicks to Ross. Denied for the third time. He's 0 for 3. And here we go. Shumper running it up the court. There's 49 seconds left here in the second. Ross with it. He's against Fry. And Ross with the slam. Oh, look at the <laughs> handles. <laughs> Gets through the D and then powers it home. Such a pretty move inside. Uh, Clark, how do you stop that? You don't, Kevin. I mean, as a defender, you got to just stash that one in the memory bank and make sure it doesn't burn you the next time. And the Cavaliers will go with a different look here. Thompson, he's checked in for Mozgov. Love comes in for Channing Fry. J.R. Smith's checked in for Shumpert. And Kyrie Irving subbed in for Matthew Delavid over. And Toronto also making a switch. DeMar DeRozan, he's checked in for Ross. On the wing, James. DeRozan defending. Irving with the ball. Back to James. That will come in. It's in. Oh, wow. He nails the buzzer, Peter. And that's a big bonus for him to end the quarter as he just beats the buzzer. That's a... And a... It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hi again, everybody. Ernie Johnson alongside Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jack for the Cavaliers. They've hung tough in what was a closely contested first half. If what we've seen in game one so far... All right, and that'll do it for us here. We now take you back to the... Welcome you back to the Eastern Conference Finals here on 2K Sports. And on the floor for Dwayne Casey starting the second half. Lowry and DeRozan are the guard tandem. Patterson is the four with Dallin Tunis in the middle. And it's Carroll in at the three spot. Cavaliers leading. Outside Irving. Thompson a screen on Lowry. Irving passes to James. He got an advantage there off the pick and took it right in. James has got six points. Boy, they are passing the ball very crisply right now. They really are, and their last three buckets have come by way of an assist. Lowry against Irving. Carroll for three. The rebound by Kevin Love. And that's playing into the hands of the defense right there. No way you can sneak that shot by him, Greg. I mean, he was all on top of that one. Back to LeBron. An easy two points on the layup. And it's a six-point Cavalier lead. Some defensive breakdowns are starting to show up now. Their last four buckets allowed have come from very close range. Yeah, high percentage shots are what they are getting in terms of the attempts, and that's just not going to get it done. They've got to figure it out. A different look now for Cleveland. Channing Fries checked in for Tristan Thompson, and it's Matthew Delavidova in for LeBron. Alan Junis sets a screen for Lowry. And again, Toronto no luck. Cleveland leading by six. Irving drives in, and the layup's good off the glass. Irving's got his second basket. Great way to start to have easy layup against some soft people. DeRozan against Irving. Outside DeRozan. 
Valanchun is inside. Guarded by Franz. And that one's good. Almost an impossible shot to block in the post. The defender can't give up that much of a height advantage and expect to contest it. To the middle. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Delavidova. Fry has got the lead up to eight now for Cleveland. Outside DeRozan. There's 42 seconds left in the third. Another miss by DeRozan. Here's Fry. Cleveland moving it around. Irving for three. And it's Toronto with the rebound. Lowry drives in. Out of bounds. Cleveland will take possession. That's a major mental mistake. I mean, there's no other way for me to describe it. He didn't know where he was on the court. That's a that's a that's a basic fundamental. You have to be alert to where you are. Mozgov, he's checked in for Cleveland. Come on, Shepard has come in from Matthew Delavidova. Now here is Irving. Let's it go from deep. No good trying to beat the buzzer. Hello and thanks for joining us, folks. The fourth quarter of play should begin momentarily. Cleveland leading by eight. LeBron and Love are the talented pair at the forward position. Kyrie Irving and J.R. Smith at the guard set. And it's Thompson in at the five. So that's who's on the four for the Cavaliers. You know, he might be small for a center, but it doesn't really matter because he can jump out of the building and what do you guys think so far about the offensive approach for the Cavaliers anytime you get as many points in the paint as they have you know you've got a good thing going and you just want to keep it going yeah and the other thing that they've done well is they've really attacked the gaps of the defense with quick decisive drives down the lane Chris pass into the paint now Irving Out to Smith. No one near him. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Irving's got six assists in the game. Raptors trail by 11. It's DeRozan with the drive. Can't hit. Good D by Love. Usually if he gets to the rim, he's converting it into points. But the defense stood tall there. Thompson dishes to Irving. There's the triple. And he gets the bucket. And the Cavaliers lead by 14. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket, coming off a pretty pass. Well, when you look at the assist total, heck, they've been clearly the better team. Some changes for Toronto. Valanciunas, he's checked in for Biombo. Damari Carroll comes in, and it's Lowry in for Joseph. And DeRozan kicks to Valanciunas. Thompson with the rebound. Thompson's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. you got to give them a lot of credit for the job they've done on the backboard. They've done a lot of things well today, but really it's about what they've done on the backboard that's at the top of that list. And a great job of taking advantage of the steal there to get those easy ones in transition. You know, that's exactly how you draw it up, Greg, on the board. I mean, good defensive work, aggressive play in the open court. Those two things are hand in glove when they work together. We've gone about a minute and a half into the fourth quarter. Love the pass to James. Outside Irving. And there's the call on Kyle Long. That is his first foul of the game. Carroll against LeBron. And he can't bank that one in. Raptors trail by 12. Here's DeRozan. No good on the triple. It's just been a brutal outing for him. He still hasn't managed to make a shot. And the team is struggling because of it. Man, if ever there were a way to kick off the NBA Conference Finals, this is it. Going to be a table-setting victory here in Game 1 for the Cavaliers. Not only did they shoot the ball better, but they had more assists. Well, the ball movement was good. The player movement was excellent. And you only get assists when guys make shots. 
No surprise here. Just a big-time performance for Irving. And the way he was able to dice up their D with his passing really made things easy for everyone else on his team. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D out of position, you could see the frustration on his face. Here's DeRozan. DeRozan can't get that one to fall. And there have been some terrible shot choices here, Kev. That's not a good look at all. And that's just a little more for these fans to cheer about as they get ready to celebrate a W. Well, let the party start. The celebration begins, and they're going to let their guys hear. And the ball goes out of bounds. Nice touch by Love. We've got 13 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. From about 16, and he nails the jumper. That mid-range jumper is just another one of his weapons. From deep. Oh, he got hacked on the three-pointer. He'll head to the line. Yeah, he, there was definitely some contact there on the three-point attempt. You have to avoid fouls like that. As a defender, challenge the three-point shooter, but run by him, not into him. He hits the second from the line. And he nails the third. So we see the Cavaliers taking the win here. A pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You know, Kevin, momentum so, so critical. And you know they'll 